Yeah, people, a lot of people don't know this, but I do like gospel music. I like church music, you know. I like Christian music. Um, this next song here is by a group I really love them. Old group. Um, I have uh, family members that love this group. Um, my stepdaddy loves the music. My mom does. My granddaddy, Riley, had a 45 of this song here. Yeah, I remember living on Alabama Avenue. My granddaddy, Riley, had the record, When a Man Loves a Woman by Percy Sledge. And he also had this one. Uh, Mighty High by the Mighty Clouds of Joy. I think it was 1975 or 76 or 77, something like that. First introdu introduced me to gospel soul, you know, or soul, you know, um, gospel music. And up to the point now, if somebody calls the police or my mother on me, hey, I'm going to do this one time, so. I'm just hoping my mother don't bail someone on me and <laughs> shut me down or from downstairs, somebody goes up the second floor and gets her or call the police on me, but I'm going to do this song, okay? And it's by my, the original Mighty Clouds of Joy. And the name of the song is Mighty High. And I hope y'all like this. It's a favorite of mine. I love this song. Man, this song right here is bad. <laughs> bad to the bone, I mean, for real, so. <laughs> Take the soul off your mind, ride the mighty glory, listen to my story, and ride the mighty high. Take the load off your mind, ride the mighty glory, listen to my story, and ride the mighty high. Take the load off your feet, heed what I'm saying, heed what I'm saying, you will set your mind at ease. There was just a man, the old man in me. God shifted all my trouble, yes, he did. Set me free, set the load off your mind. Ride mighty glory, listen to my story. And ride mighty high, take the load off your mind. Ride mighty glory, listen to my story. Ride mighty high. He saw the man that I could be. Let him be your leader. He's so good and set me free. Listen to my story. Listen to my plea. Let him be your leader. He will aim your business. I'm going to ride. The mighty high. Yeah. Come on, ride. The mighty high. Ride, 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 ride,
47 years old. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Lord God, I am 47 years old. Mm. 2013 God took away my smoking, cigarettes, <laughs> alcohol, drugs. <laughs> Recently, <laughs> caffeine. Oh, wow. And emphysema and COPD. Somebody told me today, they said, they had um, to get some more inhaler, some more um, pro-air, albuterol, that's the inhaler medicine, and some oxygen. I'm like, well, I used to have COPD and emphysema, as well as cancer. And it was like, what do you mean you used to have it? You always have it. I said, no, I have a God that is greater than to deliver me. I said, so I used to, I used to have it <laughs> in the past. I don't have it now. I don't claim it. I don't go get it. I can be around people to smoke. I don't can stand the cigarette smoke. Uh, it's nasty. I can smell on someone. If they try to hide it and cover it, mask it, or whatever, you can still smell cigarette smoke if you don't smoke. So I thank God for my deliverance. No, and I told him, I said, I am a living witness. I said, you can ask the manager, my parent, my mom, my stepdaddy, anybody that knows me that was here before 2013, a manager and a social worker can tell you, I did have to be on oxygen and the inhaler. And I did, I couldn't walk, even though I was probably a buck and a quarter, you know, small. I couldn't walk from here to that mailbox in the front of the lobby without giving out a breath. Now, I have more breath being obese. Well, that just tells itself. I just, you left the person standing there, I said, well, I said, what you believe in? I said, you can believe in something that happened. I said, that's all I'm going to say is, you know, used to as a point when I, um, having emphysema is, is, is a past sense for me, so. I had to just give him my acknowledgement to God and give him the praise for that. And so this year, I do not smoke cigarettes and I do not drink alcohol. I do not use drugs. And um, I'm a better person for that, I think. And um, I don't go to church and I'm not going to be a perfect saint, you know. But um, I still have desires and I still have lust of them. And so I love women, I always will. But um, I don't got every I and every T. But I do have a, a big, my, my faith is bigger than a mustard seed, and I do love the Lord. So, saying that, I hope y'all enjoyed the, the, the song and the music that I've done, the gospel music that I've done. And uh, please comment, let me know what you think. Thank you. you know, God bless you all. Thank you for your support. I really appreciate the support I'm getting up here. And I hope you all really enjoy my uh, video. I hope someone's sad and depressed and you want to end your life. Don't end your life, please. Your life is too precious, believe me. I don't tell you this just to be saying it, just to get famous and internet famous and be from a nobody to a somebody. I don't care about all that. I don't care about the money. I mean, I'm doing this because I care about people. I don't. I, I hate to see, I've seen too many deaths around me in my lifetime. A short life, I have seen a lot of death, and I don't like death. And so, please live. And um, live for something. So, God bless you all. I'll see you later. Good night.